Starting a record label can be as simple or as complicated as one can make it. However, there are various requirements that are mandatory to be considered legitimate. Legal formalities. There is no requirement to establish your music label as any specific legal entity. The scope of this video does not go into any detail of entity options such as sole proprietorship, corporations, LLC, limited liability companies, along with a host of other types of entities. There are many resources on the internet that can be referenced for direction. Bank account and tax verification. If a person, or group of people, expects to be paid as a music label, a legitimate bank account has to be in existence, and they are required to submit tax information relating to themselves or their business entity. Depending on the distributor, they may require bank account and routing numbers. Some distributors use secured payment services like PayPal, I advise using another secured payment service, many have had problems with PayPal. Contracts If the music label plans on distributing the works of others, then the label should have standard form contracts that fit the needs of musicians and producers who choose to have their musical works distributed through the label. Standard industry recording contracts can be found online and can be modified to your needs. Other potential contractual relationships may involve album distributors, engineers, and or graphic designers. Relating to potential musicians or producers, who may come on board, it is best to spell out exactly what your services entail and what they should expect from your label. Many artists expect the same treatment from an indie record label as from a major record company. Of course, most indie labels do not have the same resources as the large majors, and this should be made very clear. In most cases the artist should be plainly told through word of mouth and company documents that they are ultimately responsible for certain aspects such as engineering and marketing their music. The indie label in many cases is simply taking a cut of any profits derived from the sale of the music. However, this is not always the case, so it depends on the label. Make sure you make no misleading representations to potential artists. You will be sorry if you do so because people love filing lawsuits. Websites If a music label decides to direct sell albums or merchandise for instance, the label may want a website, which is not always necessary. This video does not go into the details of website development for a label. However, the label should ensure that their site is user-friendly and that transactions can be performed with ease. Do your homework before you use a web hosting company. Some have quality and service issues. Have all the information at your fingertips and get your copies of Start Your Own Indie Music Label, Everything You Need to Know, and Start Your Own Indie Publishing Company, Everything You Need to Know. Or really save and get discounted PDF copies. Just click on the link below.